Carmen, I guess you got as far as what I am right here. And then you clicked on the word trace and you move this guy out of there. The next thing that I do is I go like this, highlight everything and say, object, release compound path. And then I click off so nothing is selected. And then I make sure that I just click the outermost layer. So I don't wanna drag a box around it because I don't wanna get all of those little boxes. I just wanna grab the outermost layer and I'm gonna come up here and change that to black. And then I'm able to move that off and I have the other fellow under here who's still ready to be colored. So again, let me repeat. I'm using my undo button to get back to where I was originally. Okay, we have him. Let me go back another one or two. We've got all of this selected. I'm going to hit trace. And then I'm going to move this out of here. I'm going to highlight all of it and come up here to object. And there's several ways to do this, but this will work for you. Object, release, compound, path. And that makes all those crazy little boxes. So I don't want to color that black right now. I need to click off of it and then just click on the outermost part. If I were to color it right then, everything was selected and it would all turn black. So now I come up here to the color, change it to black, and then I could just move that. Whoopsie. Oh dear, I moved something underneath. So let me undo. And then I can just move this guy right off of there and begin coloring this whatever colors I like. Just like that. I hope this helps.